The U.S. Department of Education is making $108 million in financial assistance available to Gov Guam, and the GPSS chief is relieved that there is finally some good news for her department. Because for so many years we just have lacked uh, the funds that we needed to ensure that our facilities are modernized and that students learn in environment that's conducive to learning. The money is being provided through the State Fiscal Stabilization Fund, a program under the Obama Stimulus Package. Gov Guam will be able to use the funds to address various educational needs. In particular, the money can be used to repair the now vacant JFK High School in Upper Tumon. Schaefer says she has several ideas on how to put the cash to good use. We certainly can use that for our capital improvement projects that have not been fully addressed by the bond proceeds that was uh, given to us um, last year. We also want to ensure that our classrooms are fully equipped with technology so that our students' computer skills will be upgraded. I do believe that we can modernize our schools through this funding, so we're looking forward to that. However, the funds come with strict federal guidelines and oversight, and not all of the money can be used on education expenses. 81.8% of the money can be used for the support of public elementary, secondary, and higher education. The remaining 18.2% of funds are allocated for other government services, including the establishment or implementation of a credible financial management system. Schaefer says she will ensure that every penny of the $108 million is accounted for and that it goes to where our priorities are, and, and that certainly would be right there directly benefiting our students and, and our teachers. Nick Delgado, PNC News.